Oh shit, motherfucker, goddamn, kicking bitches out the condo. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Who's the Boss? Who is I like to say, Who's the fucking boss? It's your boy, Boss P, and today we're talking about. Yeah, you guessed it. Kanye West. Homeboy's in the headlines once again. Motherfucking Kanye West just did an interview with uh, Hollywood Unlocked. Um, shout out to Jason Lee. Um, uh, in the interview, he touched on a lot of different subjects. The two we're going to be discussing today is, of course, Kim Kardashian and uh, also controlling his own narrative. That, that, that was really big controlling his own narrative but listen man before you start to you know try to control your own narrative homeboy you need to control your wardrobe control your fucking dress code kanye because you're still looking like a fucking ghetto astronaut in a big ass boots getting ready to blast off and you know go to the moon and beg for change and start panhandling on mars or some shit so control your wardrobe bro you know what i'm saying but anyway um, he's tired of the, the media taking advantage of him and uh, twisting his words around and making it seem like he's crazy or as he likes to say, gaslighting him. Now, as far as Kim Kardashian is concerned, I, I, I don't know. It didn't come off as though he was angry or upset with Kim. I, I, it, it, it sounded more like he's disappointed. You know what I'm saying? He touched on uh, an incident where he went to go. Uh, pick up his kids at school or drop his kids off or something and security actually stopped him kanye said he's tired of that shit he said that shit ain't finna happen no more he ain't having that shit no more man i don't understand how kim is trying to uh separate this man from his own fucking children he has four kids with kim kardashian i mean they've been married for a minute now and it's the kind of bullshit she's gonna pull all because of motherfucking pete davidson um apparently he was in the house when he tried to you know roll up there and security is like fuck that you're not getting in here i guess they're afraid of a situation arising where kanye loses his cool and him and pete davidson get into it um it's also been reported that pete davidson is a little shook of kanye west um uh i don't know much about pete or his history i just know he made a motherfucking movie about staten island or some shit but yeah man kim man you need to cut that shit out i mean uh, this man honestly honestly this man has taken you to another level you know what i'm saying he's taking you to another level it's not like the man you was married to before um chris humphreys or even a motherfucker before that this is this is kanye west he's on another level you know what i'm talking about you doing some fucked up shit to him you know what i mean but um kanye you know what i'm saying i gotta rip you too brother i know you've been in love with kim for a minute but bruh you've seen how she treated men in the past she gets with men who are famous extracts as much clout and fame from them as she possibly can then she moves the fuck on you are no different bruh she's doing the same shit to you and pete davidson you are on notice because motherfucker you are just the rebound guy all right she's doing this shit to make kanye motherfucking jealous how are you gonna be on snl and bitch you on 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 stage kissing on pete davidson while motherfucking kanye's in the audience you doing that shit to make him angry you know what i'm talking about you 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 not, not doing that shit because you fucking in love with pete davidson who the fuck is in love with pete davidson bitch you just trying to make kanye angry and i don't know if pete davidson is hot right now or whatever but yeah man it's definitely a clout move she, she's definitely clout chasing or something but um yeah kanye touched on something else apparently there was um some news out there about there being another sex tape between her and ray j kanye said he get on a flight right away on a red eye flew out to meet ray j ray j pulled up at the airport handed kanye the laptop he flies back and hands the shit to kim this is how hard he goes for his bitch this is how hard he goes for his wife, yo. You know what I'm saying? He gave it a shit, and he says at that point she started crying. The bitch broke down because she realizes that she has been and is continuing to be used. You understand? But, bitch, this is how you blew up in the first place. Ray J fucked you. You sucked his dick on tape, and you blew up after that. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody wanted to know who was this bitch Ray J was fucking. You know what I'm talking about? But, yeah, man. Yeah. Kim stop that shit trying to keep the motherfucker from his kids, man. That shit is fucked up. But Kanye, you should have known what was going to happen. You know how this family uses men, especially famous men, to further their own agenda and their own... I don't, I don't know, trying, trying to pursue their own ventures and shit. 
But yeah, man, um, Pete Davidson, you need to get out while you still can before you turn into motherfucking whatever the fuck Bruce Jenner turned into. You saw what they did to Lamar. You know what I'm saying? What they fit to do to Travis Scott, you know, remains to be seen. But the shame shit is going to happen to him. Get the fuck out while you can, bro. And Kanye, man, brother, you sounded good in this interview, bro. You really, really did. I'm proud of you. Um, you sound positive. You sound strong. You sound healthy. Mentally, you sound healthy. You know what I'm saying? So big shout out to Connie. Big shout out to Jason Lee for doing the interview. Um, I think it was a dope interview. It was a dope interview. But anyway, that's all I got for y'all today, ladies and gentlemen. Until we meet again, please be safe. Watch your back and wear a condom to catch what comes out your nutsack. You heard? It's your boy, Boss P, and I'm out. <laughs>